today we're gonna do a Valentine activity. We're gonna we're gonna do a heart, and we're gonna get a coffee filter, a water bottle, a water um, spray bottle. We're gonna get some markers with different colors, pink and reds. It could even be purple. Another pink. And if you have a stencil uh, at home, you could use a stencil. Uh, you could buy this at the Dollar Tree. So we're gonna do a Valentine, and you're gonna cut the, the coffee filter into a heart like this. And then you're gonna let your child draw on it, and then you're gonna spray the, the you draw a space? Yes. <gasps> yeah, we're using the color red and pink. All the, the colors of that. Okay, color your picture. Do some hearts. You don't want to do hearts? No. You could draw a dinosaur. You could draw anything you want. Make any shape you want. I want I'm making some hearts. Beautiful little hearts. See? I'm making some beautiful little hearts. Look how awesome. I'm using all the colors of red and pinks. Let me make this little one right here. Look at that. My beautiful heart. And this could be good for toddlers and it could be good for preschoolers, three-year-old, four-year-old, two-year-old, five-year-old. <laughs> Kids will love this activity, and they could do it for their grandma, <laughs> their grandpa, anybody in their family, any member of their family. They could do this activity, and they'll have fun, you know, and uh, maybe um, on the TV because they will be busy doing this kind of activity. This is a fun activity that's going to work the fine motor skills, the eye coordination, And you make colorful little, colorful. You could do little dots. Yay, look at Ethan. He's doing little awesome dots. Look, I made a tree. You made a tree too? Yeah. Ooh, I'm going to do like a little zigzag swirl. You could do a little swirl. Little swirl here. Look, I did a zigzag. You did a zigzag? Awesome. Do a little more dots. Beautiful. Look, I made a dog. You made a dog too? Yeah. You're doing awesome. Look, you want to use the stencil? Look, I made a fruit. Yeah. You want to use the stencil? Shade it in. Shade it in. Yeah, shade in right here the spaces. Shade in like this. Wait, wait, wait. Wanna you wanna shave this heart? Shave this heart right here. You wanna do that one? Let's see how I come out. Let's see. <gasps> you made a heart! How awesome! Where's the lid? You wanna use it right now? Okay, we have to put the lid back. Remember to always pull your cap back so the marker won't dry out. You want red? Okay, yeah. here's the red. You want to shade another one? Yeah. Okay, let's shade. You want to shade this one? Yeah. Is this one big or little? Um. It's what? It's big or little? This big. One. Big? Want to shade this one? No. Yeah. 
Ethan is working his um, fine gross motor skill, his manipulative skill. He's working his eye coordination. Yay. This is good for the pre-writing, working the pre-writing and using your creativity, imagination. Awesome. Ethan is make, making beautiful drawings. Look, I made it up in the sky. You made it up in the sky? Wait. You made dots, you made a, a zigzag, you made a heart. Whoa, that's, that's beautiful. Look. And who's this heart for? Shut it down. I'm real cold. And who's this heart for? Who are you going to give it to? Look, I made a clown. You made a clown? Yes. And draw some wool this side. Mmm. Draw some more. It's coming out so pretty. And okay, now we're going to get the spray bottle and we're going to spray. First, mommy's gonna show you, okay? Look, you spray, you spray like this. You spray it, spray it, spray it, spray it, spray it. Now it's Ethan's turn. You're gonna spray your coffee filter painting. Will you, will you color it with a marker? Okay, that's gonna work his um, fine motor skills. Good job. Ooh, it's coming out so pretty. I love it. Okay, show to the camera your artwork. Okay, let's show to your, the camera. This is how it looks, the final work. See? And Ethan's. Wait, wait, wait. <laughs> Look at Ethan hearts. Now we're going to let it dry, okay? Oh. Let's let it dry. We use the coffee filter to make the, the drawing or designs. You could have the child do any kind of design they want. They could do hearts. They, they could do zigzag. They, they could scribble. It could be for any ages from two to five or six. And they could use, mar uh, they could use markers. Right now we're doing like a Valentine theme. And we're gonna, um, you cut it up into a heart. And you could use stencil, you could use a baby wipe to do the designs too and let the child dry and then it will dry up. And you could keep it as an art. It's like an art and craft for the, for the little ones, for the toddlers and preschool. It could even be a teacher's activity. You could do different designs with the uh, baby wipes. So, um, you could uh, cut up a heart and then let the, the child draw free freely or you could help the child by doing little designs and then you use a um a water bottle the water spray bottle and you spray it and it will um uh, uh, make a little leak and make a little cool design and you spray like this uh, baby wipes now. No, 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 no. It's for... Huh? What's the time to put it? Ethan is going to spray the baby wipes. Spray the baby wipes. I see Ethan spray the baby wipes. Spray it. You have to spray it like this. Wait, wait, wait. It's like a tie dye. It's like a tie dye. Also, experiment. Yeah, 
Hello. Okay. We're continuing with the with the Valentine uh, arts and craft. We did this. We got a cardboard and we cut into a heart. We're gonna do like a wreath. We're gonna do a little decoration, and we're gonna put a pom pom, some pom poms, and we're gonna put some stickers. And hearts, we need to put some eyes and some glue and some glue eyes. Let's see. Put, sit down. Let's see if I could see. Is that Ethan behind the heart? Oh, ah, your mommy ah. heart. Okay. No, first we're gonna put the sticker. First we're gonna put the sticker. Okay. Can you take the? Can you peel off the sticker? You have to peel it off like this. Peel it off. You have to peel it. Yeah, you have to peel it off like this. So this is working the fine motor skills. I don't know. I don't peel. So we're gonna peel it and we're gonna put it. Wait. Put it, put it. Stick it. And you could get this at the Dollar Tree. You could get it on 99 cent store, Hobby Lobby, Michaels, any art and craft. You have to you have to peel it off like this. Look, you have to peel it off. I'll help you and then you peel it off, okay? If a child doesn't know how to peel the sticker off, you could help them wait, by, wait. by peeling a little bit off because it could get a little bit uh, tricky for them. Mm -hmm. Here's some more. This is gonna work their fine motor skills, Maybe. their coordination. Maybe. Now we're gonna use the glue. And Ethan is going to glue. He could do, he could glue it whatever the way he wants it. He could put it on the, he could put it on the uh, paper itself. Or he could put it on, on individually on the pom-pom. And stick the, the pom-poms around the, the heart shape. And that will distract the kids. They'll be working their uh, creative skills, their coordination, their fine motor skills. On their eye coordination and they will help them develop their hands and the pre-writing and him squeezing and the manipulative um right Ethan how can I do oh you need help this is this is how you do it look you Wait. squeeze Now you're gonna squeeze. Okay, squeeze. Okay, that's it. Don't pull out, okay? And then you're gonna put any empty spaces. And you're gonna fill it up. And use your creativity. Good job. Uh, at that time, that was in the Dollar Tree or, or 99 cents. It didn't have no red pom-poms or only pink. So I had, I had to um, buy any colors. And you could work the holidays with the child. You could work Valentine. You could work Christmas. You could work, uh, work uh, any kind of holidays, Thanksgiving. You could do art uh, craft at home. Or at school, if you're a teacher, uh, this is a great idea to use to talk about uh, holidays. Because um, uh, uh, February is um, uh, Valentine's. So we're doing a Valentine arts and craft activity. And this is great because it's going to keep the child uh, occupied and... Um, 
and you're working with the child and you're helping them, you know, develop their hand coordination, their eye, and their manipulative um, skills. Good job. Beautiful work. Look at that. All those hearts. And who are you making this for? I'm making this. For who? I'm making a big heart. Yeah? Uh -huh. And who are you going to give it to? I'm going to give it to Daddy. For Daddy? No. I'm going to make him so beautiful. <laughs> yes, he is. He's going to love it. Yippee! And what color is this? A pink. And what color is this? Red and purple and green and pink and purple. And what color is this? Wait. That's going to be so excited and going to eat her food and go to sleep and just to a surprise and kill it again. And your series is sick and old and golden and chuck all the on the So Ethan finishes on uh, our craft, so he put some stickers. Wait, mom, mom, some mom, heart stickers mom. and pom poms. Mom, mom. Show it, show them your heart. Ethan's heart. Finish heart. Beautiful. Ethan's heart. Ethan's artwork. Beautiful. Do you have anything to say about your artwork? Yes. Yeah, what do you want to say? I want to say, I want a beautiful heart to love for mommy. <gasps> Thank you. Very nice. 